Hey man, it's Kevin Smith. Hey, this is Jay Music. Hey, I'm Scott Snyder. I'm Cena Grace. And you're listening. You're listening to. The- and you're listening to the Absolute Geek. The Absolute Geek. Absolute Geek. Absolute Geek podcast. <laughs> Check it out, Snoogans. So for this week's episode of the Absolute Geek podcast, I'm Matt. I'm Kyle. I'm Brian. The rapper. <laughs> the rapper. <laughs> That's what we forgot to talk about. The rapper. Yes. God damn it. <laughs> gotta talk about that we gotta talk about that the rapper all right we're gonna talk about this real quick for those of you that don't know <laughs> the fucking rapper this is the ultimate score for a gi joe fan like myself this is the <laughs> fucking dying gi joe steel brigade original send away figure form that i sent away for when I was like seven years old and you got to choose your code name. And this is what seven year old Brian chose for a code name for my GI Joe figure, the rapper. <laughs> you were, very, got, you were obsessed with lasers as a kid, weren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so this is, this is what I get to choose all this stuff. So this is what I chose code name, the rapper and the air force. His private, primary military specialty, martial arts. His second military specialty, laser weapons. <laughs> <laughs> so you're what, in charge of putting it in the DVD player, the yeah. tape player, right? Weapons specialty, XM-76 grenade launcher, and XMLR-3A laser. <laughs> <laughs> martial arts expert, kung fu, karate, <laughs> Wait for it. Growing stars. <laughs> hey, dude. That seven-year-old Brian, man. Growing stars. Uh, so real quick, I'll end it with this. Personality. The rapper's honesty and loyalty are just two of the qualities that make his MV- him an MVP in any platoon. He is not only there to share in the triumphs, but to help his fellow comrades through intense combat situations. Mean ass fucking rap. (laughs) (laughs) Sick rhyme. Yep. (laughs) All right. Absolutely. Does he have one of his? uh, Does he have a mixtape attached to his throwing star? So when he chucks it, it drops his fired mixtape. Oh man, this is what happens when your mom tells you. I found something that I forgot to give you when you were a kid. You get, you just got that. Yeah, not too long ago, dude. My mom sent me a tub and was like, "Yeah, there's some stuff in there I forgot to give you as a kid." And this is the original box that came in. It has the original, my original address on it in my house that I grew up in, and the figure is unopened. Came with like a little patch. It's he's cut in two because the ba- rubber band is so old it broke. Isn't that but, interesting that the rubber band? like deteriorated like that even though it's still in the packaging yeah man so it's fucking i don't know it's just cool it's part of your childhood so it's the wrapper custom made so, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get the shit framed i'm gonna get the shit framed you need to fucking a so you can, absolutely get- you can get replacement bands for the the waist can't you yeah, I got them i just don't want to open up the poly bag that it's uh, in. I was going to say you, you should put them back yeah. together and <laughs> the rubber band was the poly bag yeah <laughs> you need to open it up and put them back together and uh display both of them together framed so as the obvious thing to say and tim you fucking nailed it now you know and <laughs> you the battle my friends gi joe absolute geek style <laughs> the rapper is out <laughs> the rapper has spoken 